October is National Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and the Crisis Center of West Texas is holding multiple events throughout the month to bring attention to this very important issue. A brand new exhibit is using personal experiences from local victims to highlight the need for advocacy. Big Two's Jake Agstad spoke to the relative of one of those victims to hear what her message is for others in this situation. So when this situation happened, it was just, just like heartbreaking because you never think like it'll happen and then it did. So. Samela is the sister of Rochelle Zuniga. Both were in abusive relationships. Samela says she's blessed to be alive. Well, I myself had a domestic violence relationship with my um, child's father. He was abusive towards me as well, like actually tried to make me miscarry the baby. When Rochelle was 28, she was shot and killed by her 31-year-old husband, Jerome Nelson, on April 27th of 2018. He was then arrested and charged with the murder. He was indicted in early May of 2018. Her shoes are part of the exhibit in her shoes at Odessa College. This is the first year of the exhibit. Of these nine stories, six of the women were killed by their partners. One in four people in the United States experience domestic violence and the Crisis Center wants to educate the public about not just these stories, but also increase awareness of how prevalent of a problem this is. Samela hopes to help people get the courage to leave their abusive relationships. You can find someone, I guarantee you, there's someone even around them right now that would be more than willing to help get them out of the situation because they would rather have them here than to not have them here anymore. Jake Eichstead, Big Two News. And the Crisis Center of West Texas is available to anyone in an abusive relationship or situation. If you or someone you know may be involved in any kind of domestic violence case, call their 24-7 confidential hotline at the number on your screen.